Hi, I'm Liz Kettle and I wanted to show you my big bodacious book. This class is so much fun. If you've never bound a book before, this is a great class to start with. We're going to do a really simple, easy binding over straps. And this book is big. One of the nice things about it is it lays totally flat when you're working on it. Um, I'll show you some of the pages. We've got your traditional signatures. We have about, usually you say, most students have about 30 different signatures in here. I'll just show you a few of mine. Then we have some really fun fold-out pages. Here's one that folds out like this. So it gives you lots of room for journaling. Uh, let's see, we'll go through a few more. Here's, a, here's another one that folds out like that. And you can bind it in the middle, or you can bind it on one edge and have it fold out as a triplet. So that's kind of fun. In the class, we'll do this great, fun page painting so that uh, you don't have any blank white pages. So it's just so luscious and juicy. Um, well, I'll show you a few different cool painting techniques, and if you don't get too sidetracked on the fun painting techniques, you will finish your book in class. But that will definitely be your choice, whether you want to keep working or in class or um, play with the, the techniques or if you want to get your book finished. kind of depends on if you've found books before, but you can definitely walk out of class with a completely done book. Now this one is one of the fold-out pages. It goes like this, and you can fold it out, up, up, or you can bind it so it folds down. Either way, choice is yours. And you can even fold these so that they go backwards, like that. It's very fun. There's lots of different ways to show these. And then I have this set, which is great if you have a long detailed story. If you want a lot of space, it'd be fun to do a little road map or a little vacation. You could have you know one, one page for each step, stop on your vacation. And that's about it. You'll be able to um, do just about anything in these books. The pages are so much fun. One of the nice things about this painting technique is that the pages do not stick together. Have you ever done journaling or you've used uh, acrylic paints and then the pages all stick together? You won't have that problem. So I hope you'll join me with Big Bodacious. Big Bodacious book. It's really a fun class. We have a great time painting. It's like a big party in the room. We're flinging paint all around. Um, I did want to talk to you for just a second about traveling with your watercolor paper um, and watercolor paper in general. If you can afford a nicer watercolor paper, you won't get quite so much cracking on the edges of your pa book pages. Uh, and it kind of depends if that bothers you or not. It doesn't really bother me, yeah, but if you have a nicer watercolor paper, it won't do that. Now, traveling with this big sheet is kind of hard unless you're in a car. So if you're flying, um, I suggest you try and just fold it in half like this. And the reason I don't want you to pre-cut it unless you absolutely have to is that it's the painting is much faster and a lot more intuitive and a lot more fun if you're just painting the whole sheets because then we're going to be cutting them up and so you don't worry about it quite so much. If just folding them in half this way won't work, go ahead and fold them in half again so it's folded in quarters and that should work. And if you're still having a problem, go ahead and email me livekettle at textileevolution.com and I can help you out. Thanks.